Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark here on Extinction. The brand new series, and man, the first video went out a few hours ago, I'm now recording this like a few hours after, so unfortunately a bunch of my stuff spoiled, but god damn, the freaking reception that you guys had to that video, like, wow, lots of great support, thank you guys so much. Man, we also figured this out, by the way. <laughs> you can harvest the lab posts. Pretty awesome, because we need some of these resources. Crystal is super handy, um, but also this element dust you can actually use to craft shards and then also craft uh, some element itself. So we might have to start harvesting up lampposts. Yes, I never thought I'd say that in the history of Ark. <laughs> anyway, what are we going to be doing today? Pretty much the same as last episode. We just got to gear up at this point. Like right now, I have nothing. I really don't. I'm just gathering up the stuff to make a mortar, and I think we have a little bit more hide back over here, so we should be able to make that. Sweet. There we go. Let's get a mortar going. We also have enough for spyglass now as well, which is great. Um, and we can probably make a couple more arrows. Sweet. All right, cool. So we're really, we're getting, we're getting all the good stuff here. Look at this. We got a freaking spyglass already. I don't even know the last time in one of these DLC series that I immediately got a spyglass. I guess an aberration I probably would have got one super early because there's crystal everywhere. I don't know. Scorch was super hard. It took us ages to find crystal there. Anyway, um, so yeah, we have our spyglass. That's going to be really helpful for when we're actually exploring. Uh, we're going to take those out of there. We have a lot of spoiled meat now, which is great. Um, we have a little bit of metal. we got to actually look for metal node at some point here. Collect a little bit more. What am I doing? Okay, there we go. <laughs> there it is. Let's go ahead and place that down there, and let's just start crafting a little bit of narcotic for levels. And then I'll put that stone in there, because why not? Sweet. So guys, um, don't forget to hit the like on this video as well, if you find yourself enjoying it. And uh, I'm posting tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of Extinction videos. So if you haven't been seeing them, then uh, turn on your notifications or follow me on Twitter, because... Twitter sends out an actual tweet every single time a video goes out, whereas sometimes YouTube won't even send you a notification. It's great. My pick is broke, and I see a dead turtle over there. What is that? Okay, it's an archer. That's good. Kind of scared me a little bit. So, I think I kind of want to do, like, a little bit of exploring, but I also want to try and just gear up. So maybe we'll try to get to, like, metal tier in this video. I don't know. I feel like a lot of people liked the straight shot kind of recording where... I kind of just let you guys hang out for like a half an hour. We did some stuff, and uh, that was the video, essentially. So I'm, maybe we'll do that for this one as well. I know not a lot of people like a huge amount of cuts at the very start of like a series, because they want to see the struggle. <laughs> Hello. I, are these things aggressive? You know what? I kind of want to find out, but at the same time, I don't. <laughs> All right, we're not getting very much crystal from this. Lamp posts are better. Jeez. All right. Let's see. Are you aggressive? <laughs> Please don't be aggressive. Ugh, oh, he's so fast. He's a level 18 enforcer. All right, it doesn't seem to be aggressive. I assume if I hit him, he's going to definitely hit me back, so I'm not going to be dumb about it. But um, the way to tame those, well, I guess you kind of tame them in a sense. Um, you have to kill them, and then you got to craft them. So we'll do that eventually. It's probably going to be much further down the line in the series where I thought I heard something here. There's this archer here. We could probably kill him. Hello. Or maybe we could tame it and make it be our friend as we shoot it. Okay, can we... Bow, please. Bow, reload. What is this crap? <laughs> oh, I almost... Stupid archer running into the thing. Why? These arrows are hitting you. Why aren't they counting? Ah! <laughs> They're hitting him. Look how many arrows are in him. I've only hit him like three times. Okay, I don't think that one hit, but... Uh, that one's in his head! <laughs> okay, finally. Wow, that was not even worth it. <laughs> 14 hide. Great. It's fantastic. <laughs> wow. Alright. Let's go back over here and just see what we can get going. We got a level, so we might get a couple more. Let's get that going. And let's drop these in here. Do a little bit of that. And we'll just drop some of this stuff into here. Um, I will keep a little bit of hide on me, actually. It could be handy. If we find something that we need to bola, I can make them while we're going around. So, you know what? Actually, I do need a campfire. What do we, 
What's the cost? So I need wood, stone, flint. So let's just go get the stone and flint. I don't want to take it out of my mortar. Also, I think it's already crafted. All right, we got a little bit here. Um, some more rocks over here. I think I want to save those lampposts for when I have, um, what are they called, metal tools? I don't know how quick they'll respawn. I don't know exactly how long I'll be in this area as well. Maybe I should just start breaking them. I don't know. Let's go ahead and just whack this for a little bit. Okay. We have enough. Sweet. Let's just keep hitting this while we're crafting. And we have leveled once. Okay. A little bit. Sweet. Dehydrated once more. All right. Well, luckily we've got our little pond thing over here. Now this water doesn't seem very clean, but I think I might be okay. I might have the runs later, but you know, that's okay. I can't poop right now. I was gonna try and poop. <laughs> All right, let's see. What do we got going here? Um, do a little bit of that. And we can actually use that for our campfire, but I'm not going to because I want charcoal. Might as well start collecting the charcoal right now. Hello. You're really close to my stuff. You're the same one. All right, cool. Wow, this whole city looks amazing. Like, what the hell is that over there? Okay, I thought it was like a sign or something. Wow. Man, this... Oh. I heard something. I don't know what it was. This whole area is great. We got a metal node over here. Man, I don't know what I don't know if I want to live in the city here or not. It's so cool. And it would make a really, really cool tech base if I could manage that, but I feel like at the same time it's gonna be I don't know. It's not very many aggressive things around here, so there might not be too much action. You know what? Maybe just for just for fun, we'll eventually build our base out in the what are they called? The wastelands or whatever. Because that way we'd have to we'd have to constantly fight off the corrupted dinos, and that could make for really interesting uh, base design. Because we'd have to like build it in a way that would be able to actually stop those creatures from getting near my base and my teams and whatnot. So yeah, we might do that at some point. Let's see. Uh, okay, I need to keep leveling because we are nowhere near a forge. So let's see. I need, oh man, I need flint. <laughs> That's the issue. Ah, all right. You know what? I'm just gonna go around collecting berries for a little bit. I know I said I wouldn't do too many cuts, but I'm just gonna do this for a while. This is not very interesting. So, yeah, we'll be back in a little bit. Okay. So this should give me some levels. So they cost 80 each of the wood, anyway. Actually, you know what? Let's craft another bow just because we can. All right, sweet. So those foundations are probably going to give me a decent amount of XP. Need 80 wood per, so you know what? We're going to be smart about this. We're just going to drag the engram into our hotbar. So we can see when we can craft one. And we can craft it as well. Oh, man. All right. Let's see. So I gathered a little bit of berries, but I figured, yeah, this might be better. <laughs> I mean, gathering berries is really... It's really tedious, <laughs> especially the fact that you can't just keep holding down E, you have to like press it on each bush. Like you can hold down E on the one bush, but then if you go to another bush and you're still holding down E, it doesn't work, you have to press it again. It'd be kind of good if you could just hold down E like constantly and it would just keep gathering from every single bush you go to. That would be great. All right, let's see. What do we got? A little bit more and we should be able to get another one of these guys. Crafting two right now, actually, which is great. Good stuff. There's another one. All right. Yeah, this is working. There we go. Levels are rolling in. Sweet. So I learned a couple different pieces here. I learned the hide armor. I didn't learn the gloves yet, and I'm probably not going to. Interesting. So you need a gas bag splatter. So you need to kill a gas bag, or else find a dead body. Cool. 
Um, so yeah, all the forge and smithy and everything is at like level 20. We gotta get to there. So just basically foundations until we do it. <laughs> Let's see, uh, these buttons all at the same time. There we go. Let's get to one more tree and just start whacking at it and then we can start crafting. There's three, and my hatchet's broke. Need flint, all right. Probably a good time to go back over to our little mini base and drop off some of these foundations. Get another level, we're level 18 already. Okay. Let me see. Man, I like how peaceful this area is. <laughs> it's nice for the start at least. Like, I'm glad that there's no Ravagers in this map. Put it that way. Um, let's do that. Let us do that. I'm gonna drop these in as well and just craft some of that. Might as well. And we got a bunch of these. Let's get some of that going. And we can do that. Sweet. Okay, I'm not gonna place these down just yet. We might place them eventually. Man, that stuff does not weigh much at all. Sweet. Okay, let's just craft up some of these, and I could just craft a bunch of those, but there's not really much point. I needed water, right? Okay, let's get a little splash, and okay, what are we out of spark powder already? Wow, okay, GG, let's do that. And I will drop the rest of that into there. Let's upgrade our armor. Sweet, yeah. This is working out really well. We're, uh, we're surviving. We're thriving, I might add. <laughs> All right, we need flint to fix our little hatchet thingy. Oh, we need wood now as well. Let's go ahead and just gather a bit of thatch. Sweet. So we're almost there. We are almost there. We're just coming up to level 19. So a couple more of those foundations should definitely do it. You know what? Let's just craft a bunch of thatch ones. See if that works better. Yeah, that might help out. I don't know if that's going to be better than crafting the wood ones. You kidding me? Didn't even get a fully swing in it and it broke. There we go. Oh man, come on. Okay. Almost level 19. Probably just, I mean, we, eh. Yeah, I just thought of something that we could do. People always tell me I should be doing it when I'm doing this type of thing, but I never really do it. <laughs> it's where you just, how do you get it to go inside of it? There you go. So I get my resources back, essentially. All right, we're level 19 anyway. Almost there, almost there. Come on. Okay. Hmm. Let's get rid of these. Let's put that there. Can we fix our bow? Is that gonna be a thing? Oh yeah. Wait, we're not, no, we're probably not gonna be able to. I might use up all my stuff. Oh wait, no, we're gonna have a little bit left over. Yeah, we could totally fix that. Sweet. Alrighty. So, let's go ahead and just do this. <sighs> so tedious. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna be doing this for much longer. Yeah, one more, come on. Two more, I said. Oh, you're so scary, don't do that. I don't like that. They're so terrifying, like they just charging up all over the place. All right, that's enough. Let's 
go ahead and demo. Demo, and then we can craft probably one more. Okay, I thought we could get two. All right, sweet. Let's get a little bit of stone so we can get some more spark powder. Oh, we actually have plenty of the stone, so let's not do that. Dude, you leave me alone. Stop following me. Stay away from me and my family. Go. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. That's what I thought. He just, like, runs back and, like, balls me to death. You know, has anybody ever seen that, um, that episode of Black Mirror? With It's, like, the one that's black and white, and it's, like, there's, like, robot dog-looking things that are, like, attacking humans. That guy just reminds me of those. I don't even know what episode that was called. I don't, I don't know, but yeah, it was one of the, one of the episodes in the recent season. <laughs> oh, there's like creepy things like that. It was, it was good. I liked it. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, how close are we? Oh, we're so close. Where? Okay, no, they'd be in here, wouldn't they? There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll do that. We'll do that, and then. Sweet. What else would we need? We'd probably need, mm, I'd say we're looking for thatch to be able to do this. I could take a little bit of this though, just in case. Get three more. We've leveled up by the way. Sweet. Level 20, finally. Okay, let's get into our tools here then. Um, I can learn the preserving bin after. So we want these right now, that will do. All right, so we wanna work on getting our forge. So we have plenty of stone, which is good. Uh, we don't exactly have enough, but we've got a decent amount. So I need the five, oh wait, no, I'm looking at the wrong one. <laughs> I need, oh, I need hide. Oh crap, I've used all my hide, haven't I? Oh wait, no, we have more in here. Yes, all right, sweet. Let me just see, I don't, I don't know what else we need. We need flint and a little bit of stone. Okay, cool. I'm gonna drop all the heavy stuff into here. Let's get a little bit of flint. Can we harvest from this at all? No, okay. I just figured it'd be worth a try. <laughs> need like five flint and then just a few stone, but we're also going to need like 30 stone for the smithy itself, so I might as well also collect for that. Okay. I think we need like 40 stone or something for it. I play a decent amount of SOTF, so I kind of know some of the costs, but I think that some of them are a little bit different. To be honest, we probably should have just killed that stego for levels. That would have worked. We could totally have done that as well. All right, look at my beard, it's coming along quite well. Sweet. Gotta get into dyes and stuff at some point just so we can actually get the Syntec look. Okay, um, let me see, let me see. Get some of those, get some of those, and needed that and that, and there is a forge. Now we got this. We need a little bit more hide though. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need more hide. Okay, so I'm gonna take I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna place this guy here. Bam bam bam. Alright, cool. So we need to go get some hide for sure. I feel like that Stego's a good a good idea. He's level 18, yeah, we could totally take a level 18 Stego. And I mean if we die, it's okay because our bed's like right, right there. I think there's just the one stego as well, which is good. Uh, he's doing a wide turn, isn't he? Oh, not as wide as I thought. Come on, buddy. Ouchie. One more. There we go. Oh God. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let's get our arrows back if we can. All right, here is our hide. And more meat as well and some prime, cool. 
I'm not gonna need the prime right now, but definitely worth having. This is a lot of hide. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So gonna need that. We're gonna Oh, we're not done yet. Okay, we gotta wait a little bit. So we're gonna take half of that. Yeah, we just need one more ingot now and we got it. And then we need an additional ingot to actually make our pick. But that's okay. Come on. Any sec, there we go. Perfect. All right, cool. So let's cook up some more meat there while we're at it. Um, nice. Uh, we'll just drop these in here. Actually, you know what? Give me those back. I'll drop them into here instead. It just means more spoiled meat next time I look. That there as well. Oh, I thought that's a 20 for a second. I was like, wait, why aren't they adding? What? <laughs> Alright, cool. So we got our last ingot, and... Eh, let's go ahead and just do this. Might as well. We got plenty of foundations. Sweet. So... We got our metal pick, and we can't make a hatchet yet, but we can make it eventually here. Not gonna be too long before we can make that. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that. I'll just drag that into there for now. All right, let's go check out these lampposts over here. I want to see what you actually get with a metal pick, because it could be different. You might get different, different like items or something. I don't know. We're just more of what we were getting before, which is like the dust and the crystal. Scrap metal! Hey, look at that! Alright, what exactly is scrap metal? Hmm. Okay, so you can refine it in a forge. Interesting. We're gonna have to go check that out. That's new. Cool. I think there's an- yeah, there's another one over here. Freaking amazing lampposts. Alright, uh... Let's- oh, there's a metal node right there. Is it? Yeah, it is. It's a tiny one. Oh, wait, no, it's not. It's just kind of on its side. All right, got to watch our weight here. Don't want to bring back too much. Okay, cool. There wasn't that much in the node. All righty, so we've got the scrap metal. I want to see what that's all about. We're going to have to drop that into our forge and see what we get. I assume it would go like one piece of scrap metal gives you one ingot, maybe? I don't know. Hopefully. That would be great, because then we could just go around whacking down all those lampposts and make it really dark. Alright. So, I'll just put these in here for now. I want to drop this in for the moment and just see what we get. So we're going to take that out. And... What else do we have? I need water. Cool, we should probably work on a water jar here. I assume I'm at the right level. It's somewhere here, right? Water jar, water jar. Did I already pass it? No, nah, it's like further down, isn't it? Where the hell is the water jar? Oh, there it is. Yeah, right there, 26. Are you kidding me? You have to be level 26 before you can store water and carry it around? Wow. <laughs> Alrighty, well, we can not We can learn that. We might as well learn it. We're going to use it eventually. Can't really get into very much of the extinction-y stuff. Oh! Scrap metal ingots. Very similar to the standard ones. Now, I'm wondering if I can use the scrap metal as actual metal. Yeah, you can. Look at that. But it's obviously useful for um, making the mechs. That's what I think, at least. Cool. So, it is one piece of scrap gives you one ingot, which is good. I mean, it's just an extra thing that you can kind of go around and collect if you want to. And I assume they burn at the same time. We'll see, though. So that's cool. Nice. I mean, yeah. Nice little addition to the game. Let's go ahead and get more of that. You guys going to cook up at all here? Uh Oh, that was already cooked. Never mind. <laughs> I'm an idiot. All right. Let's see. Let's go hit this lamppost over here. Ah, wow, yeah, there's a couple of them over here. Let's just hunt down all the lampposts. We also got a level, which I can check out in a second. 
getting all of the element dust. I wonder where else you can harvest that from. Like, if you just break apart the city, do you just get that from everything? Like, if I can destroy the lamppost, what else can I destroy? That is my question. We actually got the the little node thingies over here, which we can check out. We could even craft some element right now if we wanted to. So let's see. Um, oh wait, no, you have to use the element to make the element dust. All right, never mind. I'm dumb. <laughs> There's the enforcer. Wow, he's expensive. That's just for a basic one, right? I think so. So this is a level one scout. Oh wow, yeah. If we had silica pearls, we could almost do that. But I don't know where to find silica pearls. Again, just another thing that comes from the very start of these DLCs. You never know where anything is, and silica pearls is always something that I struggle to find. I just figured maybe I'd check and see if I could break that. No, can't break that. <laughs> I mean, like it's worth trying if you could destroy a lamppost for sure. All right. Um, I don't want to try and destroy you. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Defense Unit. I love the fact that there's little tech uh, creatures just rolling around, wandering around. It's um, it's really cool because like they don't they don't seem to attack you, so they're literally just here to like protect the city, and I love that. I think that's a really nice like bit of lore, I guess you could call it that. It's like, hey, these tech cities are just defended by uh, tech creatures. What is this? Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and chuck this into here. So we can actually go ahead and make ourselves a hatchet as well. Oh, I grabbed the scrap, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Put that back in there. Those in there. Bam. Got our hatchet. And we gotta get rid of this one here. We're just constantly in need of water. Oh look, it's back already! Sweet. Let's go ahead and harvest from it again then. Awesome. All right. What is that box over there? There's like a weird box thing. Do you guys see this? All right. Never mind. It looked it looked cooler a second ago. <laughs> so did I see a metal node when I was running from that direction? I could have sworn I saw one. Like over here somewhere. Maybe not. Okay. Oh man, this area is so cool looking. Wonder how how long has the city been abandoned? Cause like they wouldn't just have it if there wasn't like beings living in the city. Like there's no boss in the city, so like the all the tech creatures are here to defend something, and I guarantee that they were here to keep the peace when the humans lived here. But um it seems like it's been a, a long time since that happened, because, like, this whole city's just kind of falling apart. <laughs> Alright, we're just going to regen our stam a little bit. We also got levels. Let's see. Pump that into the, the health. Get that up to 200. And we'll probably, I'd say, for the next one, we'll probably go ahead and level um, stam. Get stam up to at least 150. That could work. All right. We got more lampposts over here. Really, like, not running into anything hostile at all, which is great. I also got to keep track of where I am actually going because I don't want to get lost, and it's going to be really easy to get lost in this city. I would say that, like, PvP in the city would be kind of crazy because there's so many spots where people could be sitting. Like... <laughs> You could just be like wandering around and then like suddenly you're, be, you're being sniped from somewhere. It could be just anywhere because look, it could be up, could be down in some places, you know. Look at those, those are like bigger lamps or something. Uh, we do need water. Let's go ahead and just down all these. Sweet, that should help for a little bit. I should probably try to tame something eventually here. I don't really want to tame a Pteranodon, because I don't really want to take to the skies already. Can't destroy that. These bigger lampposts look destroyable, yep. 
Man, I'm almost so thirsty. Oh, can we sit down? Can we not sit down on those? No. That'd be cool. Um, yeah, we should probably head back. I don't see any water over here. Uh, but there is a dodo somewhere, right? Yeah, there he is. I can hear another one off to my side as well. Give me all your hide. Where's the other one? There he is. Wander into it, buddy. Uh -oh. Like, turned away and went the other side. It's a tech stego over there. Cool. Alright, I wonder what you get when you use the hatchet. Oh, you get electronics! Are you kidding me? No way! You get freaking electronics from them. That's awesome. Alright, we gotta... We gotta use the hatchet. Why am I... I've been using the stupid pick the whole time. Can we get the high? Thank you. I feel like third person's cool and all, but it's so buggy. I'm just constantly going from like thirsty to not thirsty. It's really weird. I don't understand what's happening. Oh, is that water there? Sweet. We got electronics and everything. We can get ourselves a scout eventually here, because that was the only thing that we were missing. All right. So guys, I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna make my way back to base. I'm gonna hit up as many of those as we can. And um, yeah, I think it's gonna be it for today. We'll get a scout in the next episode. Yeah, I'm making you wait. <laughs> anyway, if you guys have enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit a like. And uh, if you guys wanna see more, subscribe, hit the bell button, do all the stuff. And um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you next time.